hello friends so in this video we are going to uh, learn how to use a narrator that is a screen reader in Windows 10 to do the accessibility testing of a web based application okay so let's see like how you can start the narrator so we have two methods using which you can start the narrator okay screen reader so one is you can use a shortcut key that is Windows control and enter Okay. Start narrator so dialog. Here, uh, okay. Narrator. Button. Okay. Alt plus O. The Heads up. Will be narrator keyboard changes. We've okay. updated the narrator keyboard layout so it more closely matches the experience you may have had with other screen readers. Exiting narrator. Okay. So even you can uh, exit narrator using a window shortcut. That is control window plus enter. Okay. So the other way to open the narrator is here like you can go to the start settings and inside the settings you can find easy of access okay and inside which you will get the option for narrator okay so so narrator is basically is a screen reader okay that describe what's on your screen so you can use that information to navigate your device so this uh, accessibility okay so tool is used basically okay so for uh, uh, the disable okay so uh, and f like the person who, who are not completely able to see or the partially able to see so <coughs> basically this is a accessibility feature okay and uh, uh, using which okay so the like the person who is not able to see or who is facing a difficulty to see the text or any uh, like information present on a website okay so using they can like this tool will read it out and they can like able to understand it okay so and then as, as accordingly they can navigate on different portion of the screen and they can do the selection so basically it's accessibility functionality and accessibility like testing is important for all types of applications so that uh, to check to ensure that even the like uh, the partial disabled disabled person can able to access the application okay so and this is a screen reader so let's see like how it works okay so from here also you can turn it on okay so and even I, I have shown you the shortcut to turn it on so suppose I'm turning it on right so now it Start is narrator dialog on. okay button okay. alt plus o so heads up just say Nar okay. narrator heading level one welcome to narrator this is narrator home where you can get help access your settings and learn about new features narrator is a screen reader that describes aloud what's on your screen so you can use that information to navigate your device settings window use narrator exiting narrator okay so from here you can turn it on the narrator okay so once you turn it on this narrator functionality right so wherever you will move your cursor okay so on any application so it will start reading it out okay and then you can make the selection using a space key okay and you can use a tab to to navigate okay so between different items okay so to the next item you can use uh, tab key to navigate for example I have opened here a uh, Google page okay so like let me just go and turn it on the narrator and see how it will read it out here okay so start narrator dialog okay Narr narrator heading settings window use narrator turn on narrator link Gmail link, images image, banner, Google, combo edit, scan off, search by voice, sc sample music, Google search, press tab, new tab, link, more action, link, more action, link, more action, link, li more actions, link, m more actions, button. Settings window. Use na exiting narrator. So you have seen like uh, once I have turned it, uh, the narrator right. So I'm, I was using tab key. So using a tab key, so I'm able to select the different items on sequence on the element. Okay. So, <coughs> uh, 
like you can use this narrator okay so for any okay so type of application so for which you want to do the uh, web accessibility testing okay so <coughs> Uh, in my another videos like we will look into how to check the other parameters that is the contrast ratio for a web based application so if you have any doubts related to this you can comment me out okay so uh, even in my other videos I will add here like how you can do a complete check for uh, WCAG web accessibility okay so uh, parameters okay so level A and level double a okay so keep subscribed to my channel and so press the bell icon so that when i'll put a next video for this accessibility testing series so you will get a uh, information about it okay and you can go ahead and watch it and you can post your comments in the comment section okay so thank you again for watching this video so keep subscribed to my channel and thank you again